Chelsea's pursuit of Nathan Ake from Manchester City collapses due to the club's inability to meet Man City's valuation for the Dutch defender. Okay, so starting off today's video, I'm pretty sure that some of the Chelsea FC fan base will be a little bit upset by the club's failure to re-sign Nathan Ake from Man City. However, I do personally think that this could be a sort of benefit for Chelsea FC and I'm going to tell you why in today's video with the players that Chelsea are currently working on to sign instead of Nathan Ake. So before we do begin, if you do find this type of content interesting, please do consider subscribing and hitting the bell notification to be notified of future uploads. Anyway, with all of that out of the way, let's get into the video. So starting off today's video, after the sudden collapse in Chelsea's pursuit of the Man City defender Nathan Ake, they have now turned their attention to two other players, one being the World Cup winner Kim Pempe and the other being one of the most sought after and talked about young defenders in world football, Jules Kunde. So let's take a look at this post published by football.london. So this post does start off by stating that Chelsea have now turned their attention to the likes of Kim Bempe and Jules Kunde following the negotiations over a move for Nathan Ake reaching a halt. The report by Football.London did go on to state that Chelsea are now in direct talks with PSG over a move for Kim Bempe with Fabrizio Romano even going on to state that PSG are open to letting the World Cup winner leave this summer. And while the 26-year-old French international is happy at PSG, Chelsea will be hoping to lure Kim Bempe away from Paris to Stamford Bridge in the coming weeks. And as per this report published by Planet Football, it does seem like Chelsea are indeed making significant progress because on his YouTube channel Fabrizio Romano did confirm that Chelsea were now having negotiations with PSG for Kim Bempe. And while no fee has still been agreed, the Italian journalist did confirm that the French World Cup winner was close to joining Chelsea FC alongside Kalidou Koulibaly. And with regards to his French teammate, the report by Football.London did confirm that while Chelsea did pursue other defensive targets during the last few weeks, a source close to Football.London has confirmed that Chelsea did remain in dialogue with Jules Conde's agents. And the Blues are finally looking to bring the Frenchman to Stamford Bridge after initially agreeing personal terms with the player in the previous transfer window. So yeah guys, some pretty positive news when it comes to the current centre-back situation because Chelsea seem to be making significant progress in the possible signings of both Kim Bempe and Jules Kunde. And with all due respect to Nathan Ake, I do personally think that the likes of both Kim Bempe and Jules Kunde are of much better quality and potential because one of the main reasons as to why Nathan Ake was wanted by Thomas Tuchel was because of his versatility as the Dutch defender could play in the positions of centre-back and left-back. However, despite his versatility, it is pretty clear that he did struggle for game time with Manchester City managing just 10 starts in the Premier League and playing just 14 times in the previous campaign for Man City. Now, when you compare Ake's stats to the likes of Kim Bempe, not only can the Frenchman play in the same positions of centre-back and left-back, but when you also do take into account his statistics, it is pretty clear that Kim Bempe is the better option as he managed 30 Liga appearances starting 29 of them and in addition to this he also does manage to get a higher number of tackles won, fouls won and clearances. Okay so on paper at least Kim Bempe does seem to be the clear winner and also when you do take into account the fact that he has already won the FIFA World Cup, I do think that he would be able to really influence the young defenders at Chelsea such as Trevor Chaloba and of course Colwell. Anyway, do let me know your thoughts on the possible move of Kim Bempe to Chelsea FC in the comments down below. So now that we have found the perfect upgrade to the transfer target Nathan Ake with Kim Bempe, let's take a look at Jules Kunde. Kunde also does begin a bit of versatility due to his ability to play in the positions of centre-back and right-back. And because of this, Thomas Tuchel would be allowed the opportunity to rotate between the likes of Rhys James, Trevor Chaloba and of course Jules Kunde in the upcoming campaign if the player does decide to make the switch to Stamford Bridge. Anyway, do let me know your thoughts on the possible transfer of Jules Conde to Chelsea FC as well in the comments down below. I do hope that Chelsea will finally be able to get the deal done after initially agreeing personal terms way back in the year 2021. So yeah guys, that in essence is the video for today. I do hope all of you all did enjoy it. Please do drop a like if you did find it useful. Stay safe and I will catch you guys in the next one.